Crystal Raphael is here, everybody. How is everybody doing? Um, I just wanted to kind of um, upload some messages, some information, whatever comes in the energies of today. Today is Thanksgiving 2021. Um, as I battle my own As I battle my okay, as I battle my own um, shadow when it comes to the holidays, and even speak on it, you know what I mean. Um, it could even come off as shadow, you know, energy to to others, you know what I mean, depending on the spectrum that you're living on versus, you know what I mean, if you. You know what I mean? Agree with me or not. Um, so I wanted to kind of pull on the energies of today. See what comes out. See if there's any native um, messages, Mother Earth messages, um, Christ consciousness or any anything that wants to come out. Um, we got the Three of Cups here. Some just energies the king and queen of swords is here um then we have the sun card then we have the pentacles here king of pentacles and then we have the hierophant at the bottom of the deck um we have three of three of swords forgive me um on today the day of mourning, right? That's another name for Thanksgiving today that some natives call it. And when I, you know, read that myself, I was just like, you know what I mean? I have to use my voice use um a platform that i'm trying to build is love naturally you know what i mean like naturally i speak on injustice abuse um you know domestic violence you you guys know if anybody rock with me so therefore just the frequency of injustice i have to speak on um I want to use these moments to speak on the injustice, speak on what's real, because once again, as I look more into the natives that are that have that that have transitioned and that are still still here, um and they speak on, once again, justice. Look at this, the justice card. They speak on, well, the, the descendants of the ancient natives, they speak on the miseducation of their heritage. And that needs to be spoken. That needs to be, you know what I mean, addressed. I myself can't tell you every little thing, every little detail. I only know um, where I'm led to um, go as far as knowledge and information. Um, I'm led to, you know, by my intuition. So once again, I get what I need, get confirmation, then confirm my confirmation and it it hasn't stirred me wrong yet. And I confirm my my um, intuition by knowledge. So, yeah. And it hasn't, yeah. Um, I just want to use this day to give thanks in my own way. And from here on out, my way of giving thanks will be to... Speak on their energy. Speak on what I know is true to their energy. Um, 
and they don't want to be forgotten. You know what I mean? I, I myself know that and like the four of pentacles is in a sense of holding back you know what I mean like holding on to saving if you look at that but what do you save you hold on to your pennies you pinch your pennies on the injustice I won't hold back any past lives I'm gonna need to protect my crown my head is thobbing and I usually I usually have some covered up I don't know what I was thinking Protecting me, giving thanks. Giving thanks to the angels, ancestors, saints, truth. We thank you all for being here today, this morning. God must protect you all to keep you safe on your true love's journey. Get in the real world. I'm sorry. Can I have to do this? I'm not going. Alright. Um. Give me thanks to Saint Truth. Give me thanks to Saint Truth. Give me other messages. What other messages do you have for today? Any messages for today? I'm open to anything, anything that you need. The collective sent you a spirit. I give thanks. energy because the injustice is here you already know it everybody already know it and I want to respect 
I want to be mindful, more mindful to verbalize the respect that I do have for um, those that do like really celebrate it and go hard and continue on the tradition as I I'm led to switch up the tradition, you know. That's it. So I want to apologize because I honestly I don't want to come off rude. But I do want to come off serious. I am serious. Is what it's going to Um. Yeah, the misuse of information. So we got the Four of Cups, the Moon card, the King of Wands, the Two of um, um Two of Wands. I'm here misuse of information. I'm hearing the words, the grand scheme of things. The grand scheme of things, misuse of information. Things hidden. Things hidden. Oh, like things hidden, holding on to secrets, holding on to information. Holding on to like some some sort of truth. Not letting something go, not letting something just slip. I'm hearing like holding on to something. Holding on to injustice. This got something to do with it. injustice. I'm hearing the words rightfully so. Rightfully so. You don't want to, like, rightfully so. Rightfully so. What are messages? Releasing guilt, releasing, releasing victim mentality. Like they don't want to be the victim, but 
I'm hearing I'm hearing guilt too. Like I heard like anybody know the native energy, they'll know about the uh trial of tears where pretty much the natives were forced out of their land. They literally had to walk from the uh southern east states to um um Oklahoma, right? And um It's like the energy that comes through each year that I want to address without it being so harsh. It's simply they want their lands back. And they want their lands back not only from, you know, from like the white man and, you know, victimize, you know, themselves in that sense. Because like I had that addressed to me and then I had to do my own shadow work before I stepped up here and got the message and, you know, bring it all together and why I'm, you know, pulled in this direction. I had to, you know, put everything together and where I do see the victim mentality and people that, you know, speak on the injustice, you know what I mean, that black people went through, natives went through. We all went through, like, I understand it, but I'm also seeing it from a perspective of things going back in a divine order, in a rightful order, and going back to, like, the meek will inherit the earth, and those that didn't really stand up for themselves, or those that, um, were portrayed to be weak or anything they are like kind of reclaiming something and they are speaking and they are standing on their truth and you know to a degree if we look on the board you know what I mean like we'll see that that energy is being um looked at now it's being honored it's being um pushed more to the forefront even though it is what it is you know we still are portrayed in a certain light that is not you know what I mean like beneficial to us you know what I mean we're still taking advantage of where black men are still you know being killed and we're still it's, but with with the star card, like I just see and I feel like in a sense, you know how like literally they're walking, walking away. They're walking away from their own star, from their own like intuition, their own hope their own aspirations like literally I would see that and I see the trial of tears I do especially like with this here too I see the trial of tears Somebody is trying to dig deep in my crown chakra. Are these downloads? Because my head hurts. I've never had it hurt this bad. I'm not going to be up here long because, um, once again, I'm creating my own um, traditions as well as finding my own balance and family and everything like that so I had to come to you guys and real record first um because I didn't want to go live um I'm just trying to take a well at least Facebook break you know what I mean I may go live on Instagram later and do some um 
celebrity readings. It depends on if I if I had my baby later or not. But um, and definitely YouTube if I um if I um do celebrity readings, I'll definitely down download those because that's something I'm being kind of led to do. Something. Not, I'm not going to say it's, it's creative, but something I think that it will be kind of dope. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do it from a different perspective. Y'all already know. Um, but I think that it'll be kind of cool just to, in a sense, test myself for entertainment purposes only. You know what I mean? Test myself and see how it goes and hopefully help somebody. Um, but anything else for the collective? Any other messages? Um... Uh, any messages from ancestors, angels, any messages for the collective? Giving thanks to Native American energy today. Giving thanks. We're going to release heartbreak. We're going to release guilt. We're going to release the feeling of not being as courageous. We're going to still lead in love. We're going to still lead in passion. But we're going to reclaim what's ours. And I give thanks for that energy. We're going to release those energies. giving back to us harmony, peace, divine beauty, divine nature. Divine peace, divine energy. And now we're going to release that energy. We're releasing that energy. Yep. Releasing that energy. Keep your thighs in that, that energy. Mm. And I got the double card, the high priestess, the world, and then the two of pentacles. Divine order. Reclaiming the right order. Just here, love, hate, love, hate, love, hate, justice. It's like the battle of love and hate. The battle of good and bad. Like a battle of love and hate. It's like, what are they doing? They're fighting. Like, it's, you know what I mean? They're going against each other. But then this is the Queen of um, Cups. Right. Balancing. Balance out the wars within. Balance out the wars within. Yeah. Balance out the wars within. Yeah, peace. Balance out the wars within. Bring in peace. Bring in that comfort. Bring in that um, that healthy solitude. Healthy solitude. Yeah. Mm. 
right here. Um, I'm going to, let's do some Shaman Wisdom. Shaman Wisdom. Yeah, I can totally vibe that. I can totally see how the messages connect. You know what I mean? Like I said, me and my sister are on top of each other. And she brought up victim mentality. You know, me working through my through um my ego and how I personally do it and you know what I mean, working for forgiveness and which, you know, I stand I said and I stand on, you know, the forgiveness is there, but it's the forgetting and you know, aligning that with my um crayon gem uh Gemini aspect or whatever with it being in Gemini, like I just kind of try to intertwine and see see why you know it affects me and see where i detach from it but see why i'm led to speak on it you you see what i'm saying so i get it i get it it's time to go deeper and with other wounds but still at the same time they need being they they, they want to be be heard they want to be spoken on year after year this is their time this is their time we going to take, take advantage of government shutting down. It's their time to speak. It's their time to roar. It's their time to be heard. Let's not make the holiday, you know what I mean? It's, it's, the holidays have become very selfish and just, we're all self-centered in a sense. You know what I mean? We all want the holidays, you know what I mean? Our way. And... Crow guys, just reuniting energies. Get her face. Her face. Messages. What messages do you have for the collective? Wow, just a few cards. I don't think I finished what I was saying earlier, but yeah, I'm going to go because I am going to go to my mom's house after. Nothing is popping now. I just got to North Feminine Fire 20. Okay, this is for the collective energy. Cougar, Cougar, come on, Cougar. I am Cougar. I give chase fully expecting to win my prize. I am powerful and skillful. I am I am as at home on rock ledge as a green forest. I possess great cunning and intuition. I am born a leader challenging the status quo as I circle my prey to discern the best method of attack. I think things out and when I when I hone in, I know what I am doing. I act with focus intent. I am clear and metho metho methodical. I can never say that word. Methodical. I am balance, strength, and intuition. Sprinting into your life, I bring courage and strength. I am here to help you acknowledge your ability to lead and take charge in any situation. Leadership requires great insight. You are accountable for your actions. Lead with wisdom and reason. Be sure to think all things out and focus your intention before you jump Jump in with all fours i am genuine i take charge i am responsible leadership Ooh. Mm. let's 
seen everybody want to be a chief, but don't nobody want to be. Mm -mm. Nobody want to be like, because the words leadership came, like stood out. You are accountable for your actions. Leaders aren't selfish. Leaders aren't selfish. Um, masculine North Sun Fire. I am, uh, I'm sorry, Oak. It's a masculine sun, fire. I just skipped on over. Um, it says, I am the mighty Oak. I am strength. I am longevity. My powerful presence increases confidence and magnifies opportunities. You are the, you are, you are in the right place at the right time. Within my shadow, you will feel secure and protected. My, 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 Vitality and productivity are yours. The magic within the acorn nourishes relationships. Through my ancient energies energies and powers, you are healed and enriched. I am the courage warrior in the boreal forest. Yeah, definitely, definitely, definitely protection. We have a lot of protection in our native, native energies. I just think that they want to be... To be heard now and acknowledged, um, releasing yet again the same energies as us. You know, we hold on to guilt, they hold on to guilt, you know, in and I see once again like the overlooked or whatever, they're like kind of, hey, uh uh, no. <laughs> like they talking now, right? So I could see see that in that energy based on once again the history the history that I've been given and that I've looked in so far so it it makes sense letting go and releasing guilt but coming back strong coming back still knowing that things ain't necessarily what it seemed they still fought back that it was still wars after wars and you know what I mean? They still fought back and still um, on a quest, in a sense, to reclaim their land, you know, and that's only right. That's only right. I'm sorry. It's only right. It's only right. And I want to kind of say, you know, some street code is real code. You know what I mean? Like, it is what it is. Like, you can't, you won't, nobody won't just allow somebody to come into their home and then just, you know what I mean, bogart everything and just then take things over. So it's the same thing. Like this land was their home. They eat off, they ate off the land. Think about that. Somebody just come in, come in your home now. Somebody just come to my apartment right now. Go to my refriger refrigerator and then just say, oh, I'm taking over this. You know what I mean? Like. Like no, like no, they they want what's theirs, and that's only right. Wow, literally, literally, you can't you you got like literally. I kid you not, and I should I should upload this like literally. I placed an order for shoes for my daughter, for my daughter some boots for my daughter, my oldest daughter. They were supposed to have been in the mail yesterday at my door. The man upstairs received his mail, right? I saw it sitting up there. I saw his mail sitting up there. Two packages. I did not get my package. Somebody stole my package. The post, the, the, the mail carrier came back. Literally, he came back. His route was done with. The supervisor of UPS had him come back. He came back and he was willing to do it. Had been working this same route for years. Years now. Think of the irony of all this. Somebody stole my stole my stuff. Literally off my door. 
I'm pissed because I, I should be it's rightfully so that I can be pissed I can hold on to that yeah I can forgive I understand you know what I mean the time of the year people don't have things for their children or you know what I mean people are trying to make you know just the easy buck any way they can that's where the forgiveness lies and that's where I'm like you know what I release it I know and I am grateful and I am thankful that JCPenney is allowing me to either get a refund or to um, replace my shoes. You know what I mean? That's where I find the gratitude. But I am rightfully so that somebody has the audacity to come to my door. You understand? Come to my door and take what belongs to me. What I paid for. What I worked for. What her father worked for. You know what I mean? Because I'm ain't. i not even going to front. I get child support. So, you know what I mean? Like, literally, come to my door. Like, no. No. That's wrong. Wrong is wrong all across the board. And love naturally speaks on wrong all across the board. And we have to realize that although there could be, you know what I mean, energies that, all of us can work on during this time they want want it to be known they don't want this to be the real truth to be forgotten like you can't just sweep it up under the rug when half of the natives are still mourning they're still in mourning just because they're that you know what I mean connected to a certain level of spirituality that their ancestors won't let them forget. I understand, I like I I get it all around, but once again, the energy and the thought form it remains, and that story needs to be needs to be told as long as well as you know the speech and the the information on what it is and what it means to defend yourself now in these times to come because it ain't no more of the it ain't it ain't it ain't no more of the kind of weaker shit you know what I mean like as we ascend we have to start defending ourselves we do point blank period and I'm not even calling my ancestors weak because they was once again by all means they was not weak by all means not at all not at all. Not at all. But people people take for granted the love energy. People take for granted, once again, I give thanks. People take for granted um, the love energy. Auntie Moon, another crow energy. Cherry. A love energy. Feminine energy. Venus feminine energy and still Venus was about her shit Venus energy was in love love energy but was about her shit though 